you have a few people you've worked with who are fascinating, like yourself, Quentin Tarantino. You worked with him. Uh, when somebody asked you to describe him with one word, you said encyclopedia. What have you learned from the guy about filmmaking, about life, again? A very generous man with his knowledge. And for me, he shared it, I think, in a way that was unique in a sense of, you know, at a point in time, you know, we just was super duper tight, like, you know, like I'm going to his crib and watching movies and and just having long conversations about art and about life. You know what I mean? Um, so I learned a lot. I, I consider him, you know, especially when it comes to anything cinematic in my life, I consider him the godfather of that for me. I think, um, you know, I, I humbly asked him to mentor me, which is a very humbling thing to do coming from my neighborhood, coming from who I am, coming from, I was already a multi-platinum artist, you know, with, I mean, it was the year, it was past the year 2000 already. Mm -hmm. So it was like 2001, 2002 that I asked him to mentor me. So I was the RZA already, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I humbled myself because I saw in him a craft of brain power that to me resonated with me, but I was just a patamon at it. I was a novice at it um, because I was trying to make movies in my music, you know, trying to make videos. And, and here was a man who was a master of it and an encyclopedia of it as well. And uh, like film history, film history from whether it's the actor, the director, the cinematographer. Yeah. Maybe even the costume designer. He may know 50, 60, he may know the 50 greatest costume designers in his memory. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, this guy's brain. Both of you have a pretty good memory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and, and, I'd love to be a fly on the wall of that conversation. Yeah, and kung fu movies, most yeah, of you guys We watch. actually started, I think we, we, we started our relationship trying to outdo each other. Knowledge wise or what? Yeah, movie knowledge wise. Movie knowledge. Kung, actually, kung fu movie knowledge wise. <laughs> and I think that cat, if it wasn't another category, I wouldn't have had a chance. But at least in that category, yeah. I was pretty holding my weight. Who won? <laughs> you know what? I'll be honest and say that I may have said a few he didn't see, yeah. but Quentin is older than me. Yeah. <laughs> so he could go back <laughs> farther. Yeah, he could go back to 72. Well, I didn't see one yet, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Well, we uh, he said Master of the Flying Guillotine that I got a chance to, uh, that you commentate over today, and I got a chance to see the screening of, he said that's one of his favorites. Uh, for you, uh, the 36th Chamber of Shaolin, mm -hmm. uh, the Master Killer is your favorite. Yeah. Best best ever, would you say that's the greatest kung fu I mean, movie ever? It, it def it's hard to say the greatest ever, right? Because somebody may make another one and it depends on your own phase of life. But I I will put that first. If I want to introduce somebody to Kung Fu movies, yeah, that's, that's, that's a beautiful entry. 